Okay. So next, let's try to place an order on a futures position. And opening a futures position is very similar to opening a stock order. And we can begin this process by left clicking on the quote under the ask or the bid column at the top. So let me switch this to a futures contract, let's say a micro futures, MES. So if I left click on the ask right here, if I want to buy that, that contract, it will bring up the order ticket again. If you notice in the bottom left corner, it will show that we are ordering one MES futures contract right there. And I can make adjustments to my limit price again at the bottom. So if I want to get it for a little bit less than where the market is trading at, maybe at 47.70, I'm going to click review and send, make sure everything is correct, and then send the order. And now that is working. Let me clear this out. So if you see in the chart tab, there's a couple ways to replace the order. Of course, we can do this in activity and right click on the MES position and replace the order. Or if you're directly on the charts, you'll see that working order right here. And that's where we put our limit price. And I can update the order directly on the chart. So if I double click and I hold and drag this order higher and release it, it will automatically update that limit order to a higher price. So just make sure you know where you want the next price to be because as soon as you release it, it will update that order. So for example, if I'm trying to get filled even quicker, double click, drag it higher, right above where that candle is, release it, and then we've been filled. So let's go back to the positions tab. Let me toggle everything else off and only have features. So you see that now we have one contract of the MES futures. If I wanna close it, right click, close position. Maybe I wanted to set it a little bit higher, 47.80. Review and send, and make sure everything is good. And then send the order. And if we go back to activity, we'll see that working order right here on MES. And if I wanna replace it, again, I can do it here or go back to the chart tab and we see our entry at 4774.5 and the working order to take profit at 4780. If I want to close it, I can double click that working order and move it right where the market is trading at about right here. And then it's been closed. So now my positions tab, I don't have the MES contract in activity. Just make sure no more working orders. There we go. So we bought it 47.74.5, closed it for a slight loss of 47.73.25, right there.